Early voting kicked off today in Tennessee, and voters they definitely showed up. We went to a number of polling locations. Take a look at almost all of them had a similar scene, long lines outside of the building, some people waiting for more than an hour to vote. Here's a look at the Roan State Campus in Lenore City where people circled the building there. We also stopped by a number of polling locations in Knox County and found long lines outside the Expo Center off Clinton Highway and at New Harvest Park. WAT6 on your side, reporter Blake Stevens went to one of the biggest polling locations in Knox County. We're talking about downtown West to see just how they're handling the masses. I've spent a few hours at the downtown West early voting location and I've watched a steady flow of voters come and get in line. Many of them have waited an hour and a half or two hours to cast their ballots, but they all tell me it's been worth it. From the moment it opened, there's been a line outside the downtown West voting location. That line even extended to the end of the parking lot a couple times. Heather Murray and Joey Wervel are motivated by different reasons, but they both feel this election is important. I want my children to be safe in our local community and anywhere we, anywhere else we choose to go. Um, I want to feel like, you know, that the, the authorities on both the local and federal level have a handle on things. Making sure that we have health care, affordable health care for everyone. Um, and. Um, the Green New Deal, environmental policy is another really big one. There are 11 early voting locations in Knox County, and if you do plan to vote early, you can go to any of them. Remember, early voting wraps up October 29th in Knoxville. Blake Stevens, WATE 6 on your side. And again, just to remind you, early voting runs now through Thursday, October 29th, as you heard Blake say, of course, leading up to Election Day on November 3rd. Now, polls are open Mondays through Saturdays, but closed on Sundays, although the times vary at different locations. Keep in mind, you are asked to look at a sample ballot to kind of get an idea of how you're voting before you make your way to the polls. And to find the closest polling location to you and for a look at that sample ballot, just go to our website, wat.com. All you have to do, click your local election headquarters under the News tab.